All right, everybody, this is Chow King Jed bringing you guys some Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City. Um, man, it has been a super, super, super long time, and I'm sure you guys were wondering, well, maybe you're not wondering, I'm not really sure, but I'm still here. Uh, I've been meaning to go ahead and make a brand new video. Let me just adjust this. I went ahead and bought a brand new mic. I'm not sure if you guys noticed but I've been doing a couple of testings with it or, you know, making sure everything is uh, good, like uh, audio testing stuff, making sure there's no echo because I actually made a video yesterday, but man, there's just, it, it was way too echoey and I figured, man, fuck it, buy a brand new uh, microphone and I did. So uh, here we go, let's, uh, let's get this started got the game when it came out I was actually standing there for the midnight release and everything picked up this game and man I like it I remember playing it in poke a oh, Pokemon <laughs> what the hell am I I don't know what was in my mind but I remember playing it in comic-con I don't know comic-con Pokemon maybe it sounds the same I don't know anyway yeah I remember playing the demo in comic-con and I uh, really enjoyed it I was with my friends so uh, that just added to the awesomeness, I guess. And yeah. Alpha leader, we're in position. I'll try not to talk too much while there are cutscenes, but. Stand by. Uh, yeah. Let you guys watch. You guys must be the new Delta team. Report. Call me four eyes. My name is Bertha. Ready to play. Vector here. Good to see you again, sir. Call me Rupo. Delta Team Squad Leader. Command. I've rendezvous with Delta Team. Understood. Now find Birkin and secure those samples. Failure is not an option. You heard him. Let's move. Dr. William Birkin, an umbrella scientist attempting to sell classified samples of a weaponized virus strain to the U.S. government. You mean umbrella steel virus? No. This is a new gene-altering compound Birkin's developed called the G-Virus. It's significantly more powerful, and he's in possession of the only known samples. There's a detachment of Umbrella's biohazard countermeasure service on site who will likely try to protect him. They are unaware of this operation and are considered expendable. Aren't we on the same team? Couldn't we just pick up the phone and call? The UBCS are just mercenaries. They can be bought. We can't assume their loyalty to the company. So what's the objective? Intercept Birkin and secure the G-Virus. Alright. Game pretty much starts now. Um, pick Lupo. Because she is easily right, one of the best characters life. in the game. We're ready for action. I'm pretty sure uh, all you guys have played as avidly as oh, I have. Lupo open. is Let's definitely go. pretty awesome. Um, I do like Spectre though. <laughs> Don't ask me why, but he he's my favorite. There must be a new type of BOW. <laughs> Can't imagine those things in battle. Come on. I'll try not to talk too much when the characters are talking. But anyway, yeah, I like Spectre a lot because, uh, well, for one, uh, his passives are pretty good, but most of his abilities are not that great. Um, I guess he, he has like a little UAV thing that you can uh, activate every like 10 seconds. But, you know, I mean, that's hardly, I guess in the... Uh, you know, versus mode, it, it can be pretty useful, but in campaign by herself, like, his his abilities aren't that great because uh, you pretty much carry the team. Uh, that's not an exaggeration. If you're playing campaign by herself, you are carrying the team, so... Yeah, I just like it because I like using Spectre because he has the... Uh, whoa, what was that? You gotta pick up something. Oh, just stuff. Um... 
because uh, he has that passive to where you can spot all the items, and I, I like that. I like being able to see all of the uh, little uh, data stuff. But, man, compared to the others, he is just not that great. Also, I have not used Beltway. Um, I heard he wasn't that good as well, but Vector, Lupo, uh, Bertha, and Four Eyes are pretty much like you know all pretty good I think uh, four eyes is my favorite man that guy was just being super stingy trying not to get hit what is he trying to think here oh, actually let me pick up that um it's a green herb back here let's not waste that I know I'm missing uh some uh what do you call oh there we go I picked up that data I know there's one back there Whoa, alright. Guess I missed that. Where are they at? There we go. Yeah, I like Lupo's um the I guess the ability I have right now is uh Super Soldier. Uh it's pretty nuts actually. The only thing is uh it takes a whole minute for it to uh for you to use it again. Oh I guess we can go back down. Oh wait, no I can't. Let me just drop down. There we go. Uh, it takes a whole minute for it to, you know, for it to be able to be used again. And it only lasts 10 seconds, but in those 10 seconds, you're pretty much invulnerable. I think for like, uh, it says 5 hits, like from 5 sources or something, but... You know what? Let's let's heal some people. Where's that coming from? And I'm gonna just pick up this first aid spray. Anyway, what was I saying? Um, who the hell is shooting at me? Oh, I'm terrible at this game. Okay. You're just. Oh my God. Are you still alive? All right. I totally forgot what I was saying, man. Oh, all right. Who cares? Um, I'll watch it again later and feel like an idiot. But why are you guys shooting at me? Oh, that guy. Why is that guy all the way back? Oh, lord. Cause they're not. They're just gonna keep shooting at him. I need ammo anyway. I know the ammo crate is back here. So let's go. Let's go mess this guy up. All right, there we go. That guy. Uh, let's pick up that ammo crate, or uh, refill on ammo, rather. Where is it? There we go. Um, let me just go back to my train of thought. Uh, I'll just talk about what I guess abilities I'm carrying. I'm carrying Super Soldier. I'm carrying uh, weapons Ravager and the Samurai Edge. I think those are the best weapons in the game. Pretty pricey, especially the Samurai Edge. I think Samurai Edge is 25,000 experience points. So, yeah, it's. I mean, it's worth it, I think. I've, I don't have the other one. I think the other. I forgot. Lightning Hawk, I think, is the other weapon. The other. Uh, like, the strongest pistol in the game is Lightning Hawk. I've, I don't have it yet. I don't have enough. Um, uh, guys, want to move? Okay, there we go. I don't have enough money for it or experience points for it. I guess I do want to pick it up though. And maybe make a comparison later on. Um, more ammo that I didn't really need. Pick up frag grenade. Incendiary. Anyway, uh, I'm going to try to dodge all the idle talking. Um, talk to you guys about uh, what I've been doing lately where... Why I haven't uh, made videos. I went back and uh, remember, there's a raccoon here, by the way. Anyway, I was, I was, I was saying. Um, back into college, uh, I uh, what do you call? Why well, can't I registered for an online class? So I can't think. Uh, registered for an online class, so I guess that's been keeping me busy. 
Um, also, I've been lazy here. <laughs> I've really, really been lazy with uh, my videos. Uh, I've attempted a couple of times, but like I said, my mic was just terrible. So I just, I was like, man, fuck it. Buy me like a really nice mic. It's about like 70 bucks. It's called a uh, Meteor, Meteor mic by um, Samson, I think, is the company name or whatever. But I mean, pretty awesome. Guard this door. Do not let anyone approach. You, come with me. You guys, remember this is like one of the cutscenes from Resident Evil 2. I actually just watched that on YouTube. <laughs> Sorry, but I won't just hand over my life. All right, let's look around. Yeah, there's nothing around. The door's gonna explode, and even it like I, I hit like all the way back here. You still get hit. It doesn't. See, I'm gonna show you guys. Look, see, you still get hurt. You're like way away from the explosion. Not necessary. These guys are pretty annoying, the spec ops. Is they, I mean, I guess they're wearing body armor too, but man, they, they take some bullets, man. They think there's a herb right there. Uh, get some ammo. More of them's gonna come. Oh, somebody just texted me. Not sure if you guys heard that. I'm pretty sure you guys did. I got the Mario pause sound for my text alert thingy. Right, that guy, he's done. Repeat, there has been a security breach. Avoid contact with unauthorized personnel. I mean, I'm. <laughs> Looks like you had some company. Follow me. Let's go. Everyone on board. We've got a mission. Oh, I don't remember this guy being there. Goblin 6, what's your status? The upper levels are secure. All above ground escape routes are on lockdown. Waiting on you, sir. Copy that. Alpha team, have you retrieved the sample yet? Affirmative. Heading to the rendezvous. Understood. Man, why are British guys always the bad guys? Is there... I mean, if you're... I don't know if I have any British subscribers, but is there something about being the bad guys that you guys like or I think that's just because it's an American game you know they thought you know eh, British guys they're they're pretty bad I think a British guy would be a, a good bad guy for this game man I know I want to miss like a ton of stuff but I'm trying to keep the oh cutscene hold on Look at that beautiful hair. Even as a zombie monster, he, he still has beautiful hair. Is he wearing sandals? Looks like he was wearing sandals. Maybe he likes Birkenstocks. Haha, <laughs> get it? Yeah, no. That's terrible. I apologize for that, good peoples of YouTubes. I'm trying to joke around, but. Terrible joke. Oh, it's locked. All right, close it up. We need to move. Come on, don't forget our objective. I'm not sure what time I'm on. I think I'm already well beyond ten minutes. So I'm just gonna try to keep the um. Whoop. I'll try to keep the video at least maybe around twenty. Um. Let me know if you guys want me to split it between two uh, two videos or whatever, but I don't know. Uh, s some people prefer just the whole entire level, you know, in one video. Some people prefer it to be split. I don't know. Um, let me know in the comments, I guess, if you want me to split it up or whatnot. Because my Skyrim video was like around, what, 24, 20 some odd minutes. I know that, but... You know, 
I guess trying to keep it maybe 15-ish, something like that. See, I always get confused. I'm not sure if that was Hunk or, or one of the random, I guess, uh, special ops people. Or not special ops, but, oh crap, I gotta shoot him. I did I did uh, play this in um, professional mode and it is a lot tougher. I want to say tougher that you know the AI is like super smart or anything. It's just they have so much life. They just like man they they can blast them with like a whole clip, hit them in the head, and they'd still be standing. So it's a little bit BS if you ask me. We're actually come, like uh, coming to a close to, to the video. I think there's probably like two more corridors we gotta run. Oh shit, I think I gotta open this. Yep, <laughs> I have to do that. Is it open? Nope. Totally forgot that. Open? Nope. Alright, there we go. Now it's open. Let's pick up some ammo. I think I missed like a ton of uh, what do you call collectible data already. Oh, there's one over there. I gotta pick that up. Did I pick normal guys? Cause these guys seem to go down a lot faster. I'm pretty sure I picked normal. Maybe next time I'll I'll pick professional for you guys. So uh, you'll see. I'll probably die a couple times, but you know. At least it'll be maybe challenging. Like I said, professional just means like the AI has just. Oh no, dog! Ugh, uh, I can never, never get that asshole. I was say saying uh, professional just like the the enemy. Just... Oh, watch out for this there. I'm gonna try this out. So. Oh, what the crap! Oh, I totally missed that part. I thought this was the part where uh, Birkin attacks you. Oh. Whoops. I just wasted a <laughs> super soldier for no reason. That was dumb. Heal myself. Give a spray. Might as well waste the grenades now, because, um... Oh, that dude was dead already. Oh, see, there it is! Yep. I was gonna use Super Soldier and see if, um... He can still hurt me or whatnot, but... it, it As you guys can see, it still hasn't, uh... Regenerated yet. I think I got this uh, this corridor and one more, then the level is over. Alright. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Whoa! This is where uh, the floor explodes, so I'm gonna try this out, see if it'll work. See? Oh, cool! You don't get hurt. Sweet. Oh well, I got hurt that time because um, Super Soldier ran out. But that's good to know. All right. Come on, Birkin injected himself with the G virus. There's nothing you can do. Get out of here and make a full report to management. What about you, sir? I lost the same. I'm going back for it. 
What a badass. <laughs> like, Hunk is such a G. I don't know about you guys, but that was... That was pretty, uh, pretty gangster. Oh, I, see, I missed so many of the, uh, items. Oh, well. Because that was, that's really the only reason why I like Spectre, because, like, once the mission is over, I usually get all the items and stuff and, and get an S ranking. But, yep, um, yeah, that's Resident Evil. So, hopefully, you guys like that. And there's, like, only seven levels. Currently, there's only seven levels, so... I'm gonna try to see if I can, you know, post the entire thing up to you guys. I've already beaten the game. So, yeah, just let me know. And, uh, if you like it or not. And, um, comment and rate it. Thumbs up. Whatever you guys want to do. And I'll talk to y'all later.